Now, let's start with Brexit, and as many had expected, Prime Minister Theresa May's divorce deal from the EU has once again been rejected by British Parliament. For more on this and other stories from around the world, let's turn to our Noah Adam. Adam, Brexit thrown into turmoil once again. That's right, Mark. This was the second time a Brexit deal has been rejected. The result of Tuesday's vote was 391 to 242, a slightly slimmer margin than before, but a defeat nonetheless. MPs are still not happy about the terms, especially on the contentious Irish backstop issue. May's last-ditch talks with EU officials the day before the vote and getting what she called legally binding changes from them have ultimately failed to persuade critics. Parliament will vote now on Wednesday whether to back a no-deal Brexit. Business leaders and economists warn that leaving the EU without a deal would bring chaos to markets and supply chains. MPs uh, vote against a no if uh, MPs vote against a no-deal Brexit, then they will vote the following day on whether to seek a last-minute delay to the March 29th divorce date. May said the government would not instruct her own Conservative Party lawmakers how to vote, as would normally be the case. She also told MPs the government would announce on Wednesday details of how the UK will manage uh, its border with Ireland in the event of a no-deal Brexit.